Hello everyone, welcome to my presentation. This is Amir Zakir Imanesh. I'm happy to present our paper entitled Heterogeneous Vehicular Plutoning with Stable Decentralized Linear Feedback Control. In this paper, we study vehicular plutoning, which consists of one vehicles, including one leader vehicle and several follower vehicles. Two, IFT, which stands for Information Flow Topology, and determines the way information are exchanged between vehicles. 3. Spacing policy that specifies the desired distance between vehicles and in this paper we use constant distance policy. And 4. Or the last part, follower vehicles controllers. Also please note that the leader vehicle doesn't undergo any control process. Also we have two aims in plutooning. One to have a desired distance between consecutive vehicles and to, to have followers track the leader's velocity. For problem formulation and stability analysis, we consider only longitudinal control for platoon, which is comprised of two control loops. First, inner force acceleration control loop or namely feedback linearization part that compensates nonlinearities that we assume are completely known. Second, outer intervehicle distance control loop that is to satisfy the mentioned aims. The control we use is linear feedback control in which position, velocity and acceleration of vehicles are exchanged between vehicles those of which have communications with each other. Motivation is to formulate the problem that is more general and uses non-identical control gains and to come up with a stability analysis that holds true for a wide range of IFTs. In this slide you see some typical IFTs or information flow topologies that we come across in literature including uh, PF or predecessor follower topology, PLF or predecessor leader follower topology, BD or bidirectional topology, BDL which stands for bidirectional leader topology, the acronym TPF which stands for two predecessor follower topology, TPLF which stands for two predecessor leader follower topology, SPTF which stands for single predecessor two follower and finally TPSF which stands for two predecessor single follower. All of these topologies are indicated in this slide and you can see by their names. The schematic of a platon with one leader labeled by 0 and n followers which are labeled by 1 to n respectively is shown here. X denotes the position of vehicles and capital D sub i superscript i plus 1 denotes the distance between the backside of the predecessor vehicle labeled by i and the front side of the follower vehicle labeled by i plus 1. Let the dynamics of the i's follower be given by this formula in which f i is equal to this is equal to this formula you see which is the function of velocity and acceleration and g i is equal to this formula which is function of the velocity of vehicle and c i is the engine input which is the feedback normalization control part and is equal to the formula you see also in this formula u i is the auxiliary signal and needed to be designed properly. In these formulas, MI is the mass of the vehicle, VI is the velocity, CDI is the drag coefficient, AI is cross-sectional area, Sigma is the specific mass of air, and DMI is the mechanical drag. And if we substitute GI, FI, CI, and CI into the first dynamics formula, we get this final formula in which AI is the acceleration and ta I is the engine time constant. Also UI is the control input that need that is needed to be designed properly. Bold capital X I denote position, velocity and acceleration of the ice vehicle and using the formula obtained from the previous slide it's obvious that the state state space model for the ICE vehicle would be as the formula highlighted now. Let's assume that the desired velocity for the followers be the constant static velocity of the leader and desired distance between consecutive vehicles 
kappa and kappa plus 1 be small d sub kappa superscript kappa plus 1 which equivalently means that the controller role is to make capital D sub kappa superscript kappa plus 1 be equal to small d with the same sub and superscripts as the desired distance. Now let the distributed controller UI be as the guy you see in the beginning of this slide in which I sub I stands for all the vehicles from which the ICE vehicle receives information also we can obtain the desired position of the ICE vehicle based on the position of leader denoted by X sub 0 and also by X tilde I which is the difference between real and desired positions and if we substitute all these notations into the first formula we will have this final formula for the controller which is formulated based on x tilde s now if we substitute ui obtained in the previous slide to the feedback linearized dynamic equation we get this guy and if we do this for all follower vehicles and defining x tilde n and ki we can get this formula for the total state space presentation for plateau in which the definitions of capital sub ii and ij are given as you see now consider a plateau with two followers as a case study therefore in the state space presentation the system matrix would be this highlighted matrix using which we can obtain the characteristic polynomial of the system which is the determinant of this matrix and where it results in a six degree polynomial equation as you see here in which the coefficients including a b c d e f and g are provided now if first follower doesn't receive information from the second follower or vice versa then coefficients will be simplified as a b c d e f and g and to have negative eigenvalues for the system matrix or negative roots for this characteristic polynomial the following 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 relations should be satisfied including relation one relation two relation three relation four and finally relation five we have done simulations for the two followers case in which four IFTs are considered as you see including IFTA, IFTB, IFTC and IFTD. Also the velocity trajectory for the leader is considered to be as the one you see. It is assumed that the initial velocity and accelerations to be zero for all vehicles and initial position are given in the table. Also, the desired spacing between the vehicles is considered to be 10 meters. We choose k equal to 3 and b equal to 5 and h equal to 1 for follower 1 and h equal to 1 for the follower 2. But we let k and b for follower 2 be obtained according to the criteria mentioned in the previous slides. Therefore, the stability areas are given for 4 IFTs where b and k are axis of plots and as you can see the area for iftd is bigger and larger than the other ifts now we set k equal to 3 b equal to 5 and h equal to 1 for the first follower and k equal to 2.5 b equal to 10 and h equal to 1 for the follower 2 the error signals Therefore, for the followers 1 and 2, and for the 4 IFTs are depicted here. Also, we define an error evaluation criteria, namely EEC, and setting the same control gains given in the previous slide, the performance of the controller for 4 IFTs and the 2 followers, and given the criteria, is depicted in this figure. Thank you so much for your attention.